device invalid. Oh god. Whoa. Poor dude. So, wait, flashbang, where? Cool, I can make flashbangs? That's amazing. Oh, that's so cool. I want to use those. Cool. First, let's just switch to the revolver first, and then device invalid, yeah. Smoke bomb? Are you serious? This is awesome. I get to make so much more cool stuff than I thought. There was another, yeah, here it is. Cool. Okay, let's check the map to see where I... This round thing, I haven't been in there yet. Yeah, this thing. Oh god. The flight recorder. Whoa, that was easy. Did I win? What? What did I just do? 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 Did I just fuck something up? Oh, I can't get out. Crap. Let me out. I, I don't know what I'm doing. I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing right now. What does this do for me? Oh. What? What is this? What? I don't, I don't, I don't get this. What is this? Does this open up access to something perhaps back here? Right, 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 right. Data cell. Cool. <clears throat> okay. One working access tuner. Hack the L. Oh, right, right. And I know there was a second room that I could hack. I also want to go in there. Let's try this thing out. Tune into the code with the mouse and use the move keys and E. Cool. That was actually pretty cool. That, that took me a little while to get, but yeah, cool. Loved that. Loved that. That was pretty awesome. Stay focused, Tom. Stay focused. You're not out of the woods yet, buddy. You're not out of the woods yet. Because, like, alarms are going off all over the fucking place. Give me a break. Oh, wow. Disable security. Yeah, I was gonna say. Oh, look. 
we'll go in there in a sec. I just want to check this out first. So this is in lockdown. I would guess I can get in there. No, that door is actually open. Wow. Cool. Ah, oh, crap. That was dumb. I like this mechanic. This is fun. It might get super tedious at some point, though. We'll see. Yes, this is good. Okay, archives. To W. Chief Porter. Re Sevastopol terminals. Chief, the good news is that I'm about 80% through archiving Sevastopol's internal mail system for the decommissioning. It's been disconnected from Apollo, but I've left a basic messaging system in place for the people still here. The bad news is, whoever set it up in the first place skimmed on the hardware, and we've had some leaks. I've got Mike Tanaka looking into it now. He's a specialist... Hmm? He's the specialist archivist we called in. Seems to know his shit. Just thought I'd better give you the heads up in the meantime. Okay. Shared. An Outpost of Progress. Number one. Sevastopol. An Outpost of Progress. By Julia Jones. Desolation through Isolation. The space station that nobody needed, run by a company we all forgot. Sevastopol is now a backwater. The population is a tenth of the station's optimal capacity. Docking bays are empty, and the shutters are down in local stores and businesses. The orders for Siegson's cheaply manufactured androids have long since dried up, and the antiquated Apollo governing AI system frequently malfunctions. How did we get here? And more importantly, where have billions of dollars of investment gone? My name is Julia Jones. I have lived on Sevastopol for two months compiling this report for the Colonial Times, discovering the price our second-tier corporations have paid for their over-expansion during the race into the Outer Rim. Okay, that was it. So it was, it was a, not a really happy place. Let me put it like that. Audio. Oh, there's no audio here. Okay. And no utility either. Okay. That's interesting. So the station was already, uh, not only was it in trouble, like, not only was, like, bad shit happening before the aliens arrived here, but even before that, it was already, uh, in bad shape. It was not a, uh, wait, have I already been here? No, I have not. That is a lie. Cool. Oh my god, oh my god, what is happening, what is happening, what is happening, what is happening? No, 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 no. Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. here I want out I quit I quit I don't want to be here anymore I don't like this game I want to play tic-tac-toe I don't know where I'm supposed to go oh this is done now okay good so I'm guessing that Alien's gonna kill all the people. That's, like, for damn sure. That's like... A... Oh god, that freaked me out. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go at this... Oh, that was just me. Okay, it was my own shadow. I got freaked out by my own shadow. God, I'm not 12. Come on, Tom, you can do this. Stop being a... You can do this. There was a room that I could open with the uh, the little hack tool thingy that I got now, but uh, uh, hell no. I was gonna go straight to the elevator and get the hell out of here. I don't want to be here anymore. I hate this place. Not gonna lie. <laughs> 
I hate this place. I absolutely, positively hate this place. I don't care. I don't want to. I, I honestly. I'm not sure what this does, but I hope it does something you. Uh. What is happening? Oh, I guess it makes makes me harder to spot. I know it's around here. Oh my god! Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Please, 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 hurry up, hurry up. Open this, open this fucking door, open this fucking door and get me out of here. Hit the button. I'm out. Oh my god, that was terrifying. That was absolutely just nerve wracking. Oh my gosh. <sighs> damn it. Absolutely damn it. Yeah, I need to... Uh, I need to get a drink. I'll be right back. Alright, and we're back. Um, yeah, that was absolutely nerve-wracking. If that is a uh, sign of things to come... Wow. This is not for the faint-hearted. It's for damn sure. Ooh, this looks like all sorts of cool equipment. Can't pick it up. That sucks. Life moves fast, and it's easy to feel overwhelmed. Hello? My name's Ripley. Amanda Ripley. I need your help. Please take a seat. Someone will be with you shortly. No wonder Seekson is losing the tech race. Apollo AI. Centralizing all requests so that your important message doesn't get lost in the ether. So that's an Android, obviously. An origami unicorn. Just look at that. The drawing. What is what's the drawing of? Oh, that's the alien. Holy crap, there were kids here. That I hadn't even considered that there could be kids here. Okay, so where am I? I guess I'm here? So camera feed... That I'm gonna turn off. That's obvious. Oh, that requires three. Oh, I can turn off the lighting. But I can't turn off... Okay, gonna turn off the lighting. Go to the other room. That means I've got a lot. But I need to take a four. There we go. Go to the other room. What else can I turn on? Speaker access. Okay. And then go away. Okay, good. So this... So, I turned off the lights somewhere, only to open the doors. Does this mean that... Th yeah, this door's now open. That's great. Yeah.
Oh, it's for flashbang. No, I don't want to make a flashbang. I want to make a medkit. There we go. That's good. That's good. I want to make another one. Item constructed. Perfect. Keycard required. Iron torch required. There's another droid. So from what I gather, they're not inherently... They're not inherently, like, dangerous, but they might attack if you do something stupid. So I'm just gonna try to leave them alone. And not mess with them. That key card required. Do you have the key card, buddy? Can I help you? I need to get into comms control. It's urgent. That is a restricted area. It's an emergency. Don't you realize what's going on? Apollo has the situation in hand. Your registration is almost complete. Forget it. I'll find my own way in. Hmm. So these things are not very smart. They're not very adaptable. I wouldn't advise it. No, no, I'm not doing it. Don't worry. Don't worry, bro. I'm just relaxing here. I'm not doing anything stupid. So I'm guessing that is comms? No, that's service exchange. Okay. But I can't get in there. At least not for now. I need a torch for that thing. So I, there's no, not really any point in going there. Whoa, what is this place? Item max, low power. Oh, right. I turned off the power here. Motion tracker. Some yeah. kind of tracker. Yes. It's been modified. Yes, 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 yes. This is the thing I... Is there a problem? Nope, there's no problem. No, no problem. We're all fine and dandy up in here. Don't worry. Whoa, terminal's now back on? Wow, how did that work? Okay, I'm good with that. Personal, door override. Use, I've, I've put a manual lock on the door leading upstairs. Don't want any access until we figure out what's going on here. Oh. Error, section interrupted. Shared. Our manifesto. First published in Ion Seeks in February 2115. We don't want to show you a new world. We want to discover it with you. Here at Seekson, every new technology, research project, and discovery is driven to find real-world applications to help you. We hope you'll join us for the journey. Sure, but tomorrow together, number one. Together tomorrow, Seekson's journey into colonial space, an official history by Sebastian Sieg, first printed in Eye on Seekson, our origins in space. Let's scroll down a little bit, which takes forever. Our in space. Uh, 2034 changed everything. The advent of faster than light travel put Siegson, then known as Sieg and Sun, on the path to success. The race into space began in earnest, and under the steady hand of our founder, Joseph Sieg, our company was primed and ready for the years that followed. Sieg and Sun built the components that enabled ships to extend colonial space beyond the Sol system. As history relates, Wayland Corp was reluctant to share its FTL technologies with other corporations. Fortunately, Josiah Sieg was on hand to speculate, innovate, and produce. Without Sieg and Sun, the skies would have looked very different indeed. Audio. Play. Marie, if you get this, I'm making my way to Sieg's and communications now. I didn't wake you because I knew you'd try and stop me. Please understand, this is our best shot. Someone has got to re-establish communications. We need to make sure the officials back at home know what's going on here. Don't worry about me. I'll be back. I'm not going to leave you and Claire alone. Okay. Interesting. Override door. Okay, I've opened, I've opened a door. Not sure where to, but it is open. Human employee recreation. I get the feeling I'm skipping a bunch of stuff. I should go. Ah, I should go back. There's nothing here. I can safely run here.
pretty sure I've missed stuff over here by being a little bit too uh, too forward. Okay. Relay facility can go in there. What's this? Oh, right. That's what I wanted to go into. Coolant maintenance. Okay, so I can't open that. Because I need an ion torch. I can't open this at all. This is completely shut off to me. Okay. I get the feeling I'm going to get that torch in the, somewhere around here. Because there's a lot of closed off uh, vents here. Okay, so let's see what else is here. I don't think there's a whole lot of other stuff here. Because I don't think I could go another way here. To be honest. No, see, that's closed down. And you can't get in there. Okay. That means I was actually going the right way. Good. Pretty sure Steve's going to get mad at me for running, but whatever. <laughs> Dude, get out of my way. Move. Thank you. Okay. Let's continue. <coughs> Excuse me. Hear another one of those beeping things. I'm not really not sure if that's a camera or not. Save game. Yes. And this is a good place to end the second session. So see y'all next time. Bye bye.